The goal of the Blue Envelope program is to improve communication between law enforcement agencies and in the communities they serve. In a world where understanding and empathy uh, are paramount, the Blue Envelope program is a beacon of hope. It bridges the gap between law enforcement and our community members that have unique needs. And it reminds us that compassion knows no boundaries and that every interaction can be an opportunity for connection and understanding. So here's how the program works. Individuals can display one of several items uh, which displays the blue envelope logo. Due to the wide variety of interactions that law enforcement officers may have with individuals with a condition or a disability, it's important to have an assortment of products available to individuals who want to display the logo. These items may be a physical blue envelope, they could be a wristband, lanyard, stickers, pins, or other items that are available for free through local law enforcement agencies and our community partners, including count participating county and San Diego departments. These products allow a sheriff's deputy or police officer who sees the blue envelope logo to know an individual has a condition or a disability requiring additional accommodations or assistance during a service call or an emergency. For those who may face challenges in effectively communicating their needs, during encounters with law enforcement. This program bridges the gap between individuals and officers, promoting clear, compassionate, and timely interactions. It empowers individuals to express their unique needs and enables law enforcement to respond with appropriate understanding. This issue is very personal to me, especially as a parent. My daughter is four years old and on the autism spectrum. Every parent worries about their children and that will not go away when my child or your child gets older, especially when they start driving. So to know that our sheriff deputies, first responders and other partners are going to be trained on the best practices for interacting with people like my daughter is an important step toward creating a safer, more inclusive San Diego County.